and political developments here in the country are being very closely monitored not only domestically but internationally as well now South Africa is a member as you know of BRICS and plays a very crucial role globally joining us to discuss this this morning is Elizabeth Siridopoulos chief executive of the South African Institute of International Affairs thank you so much for joining us uh, this morning uh, Elizabeth first and foremost let's talk about the international reaction to uh, the South African elections and, and indeed the re-election of President Cyril Ramaphosa for his second term. Well, I think overall, certainly if you look at the way in which uh, the markets, the economic and financial sector has responded, I think uh, very positively, certainly in the last few days with the announcement of the government of national unity, the way in which the entire process, I think, uh, uh, ran its course, both the way in which I think political parties, uh, the majority uh, accepted the outcome of the elections, then the two-week period when there was you know, feverish negotiations to, uh, to decide on a government of national unity, the, the first sitting of parliament, all of those have indicated to the, to the world that our institutions are sound, that uh, this, there, is, there is political uh, stability. And certainly that there is a degree of continuity and that's that's always uh, that's always important but certainly we've seen in the last uh, couple of days really the rand in particular really rallying and 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 improving i think on back on the back of uh, of, of those developments and also we've seen uh, uh, really good news uh, for those who have shares in the in the johannesburg stock exchange in in, in some of the big south african companies and so overall, I think a uh, uh, really, really positive way in which uh, these things have, have shaped up. 